to the National Rating Bill. And as the Chair has said, Honorable Speaker, the committee has considered all the amendments and uh, they agree with a number of the amendments as uh, amended by our Senate, our colleagues in the Senate. Honorable Speaker, if you can protect me from the member for Emurua Dikir and the member for Kiamba, but the laughter was coming from the member for Emurua Dikir. And you know, Honorable Speaker, these people who purport to be kingpins have a problem. <laughs> you have seen the problems that uh, we have in the Mount Kenya region because of this kingpin uh, syndrome. Uh, now the member for Emurua Dikir, who purports to be the Kipsigis kingpin, is now harassing the Honorable Kawanjiko because the Honorable Kawanjiko is able to withstand <laughs> kingpins Leader, from the Mount Kenya region. We will just ask Honorable member for Emurua Dikir to keep the consultations low. That's and, it. Uh, and especially the laughter. <laughs> That's it. The laughter is choking. Honorable Speaker, I was saying when the committee uh, for lands considered these uh, amendments, they have what agreed with the number on, of uh, these amendments, Honorable Speaker. Is it on that? And the amendments. Uh, hold on, Majority Leader. The Honorable majority, Kaluma, I hope the, you are the not majority, on the uh, Honorable for, Speaker, I hope you are attentive to Honorable Ichungwa, who is our Majority Leader and the Leader of the House. Honorable Speaker, did you hear Honorable Ichunga say the Honorable MP for Mwar Dikir is purporting to be the, the kingpin? when it is something of which judicial notice can be taken, something which is acknowledged, that Honorable Joanna Ngeno is the kingpin of Rift Valley, <laughs> something which was done in public, all elders that was duly enthroned. Why should our majority leader, who is our leader, Member for Homa undermine our exploits in leadership? Honorable Kaluma, whatever flaw that was agreed on is not the flaw of this house. So majority leader, kindly focus on the bill. <laughs> Thank you, Honorable Speaker. And the Honorable Kaluma knows I said purporting because, as you rightly say, Honorable Speaker, all kingpins purport to be kingpins but are never appointed by anybody. <laughs> <laughs> Honorable Speaker, I was saying uh, the Committee for Lands has also disagreed uh, with uh, substantially with a number of amendments. And therefore, Honorable Speaker, it would only be right that we allow the committee and this house to have a second shot at this bill and the amendments that have uh, emanated from the Senate, to agree with the Senate on the ones that they agree on, but uh, also to move the House to disagree so that we can uh, have an opportunity through the mediation process as provided for in our standing orders in the Constitution uh, for the two houses to be able to uh, have an opportunity to sit. And I'm certain our committee for lands uh, or rather the members that this house may appoint in mediation without preempting debate would uh, be able to sit with our colleagues in the Senate and agree on those that are contentious and we uh, consider a mediated version of this bill, Honorable Speaker. Therefore, back to second and uh, do request the house to disagree with the amendments in the Senate so that we may cause uh, the setting up of our mediation committee. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. Back to second. I therefore propose the motion that the Senate amendments to the National Rating Bill, National Assembly Bill Number 55 of 2022, be now considered. And before I give uh, the uh, members to indulge on this one, just to note that if this motion is lost, then Order Number 10, Roman 1, will not happen. If it is lost, the Committee of the Whole will not happen. And Roman II had already been stepped down by the Speaker. That is the Kenya Drugs Authority Bill. So if this is passed, then we'll go on with Committee of the Whole. If not, order number 10 shall not be called. Member for Funula. Uh, 